Y'all going to see, though. I'm going to come in here with a talk. If Post Malone don't sell 350,000 records, I'm coming in here to talk. Why? Because I've been on it. Because I've been on it for a little while. I've been waiting and watching. Did they get a date yet? Yeah. What is it now? Next month. Oh, for real? Next month. Next month. June. He's dropping. And y'all know what that boy do. Summertime, too? And if he don't do it, I'm getting into conspiracy theorist mode. I told y'all. He's been... He constantly sells a shitload of records. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Every time out. Uh-huh. Okay. Come on. A, a lot of months ago, I don't remember how many months ago, he went through exactly what Tory Lanez went through. And his manager or him saying, hey, label got to come have a talk with me. Well, we're not putting nothing out. From that, from that, the support decreased. Dwindled off. Me and Ice came in here and talked about the weekend having a Post Malone record and not really moving too much, and right? It was a bop. Same conversation we had with NBA Young Boy and the Baby doing something together. Like you could just it's subtle signs when you see support decrease for whatever reason. Uh, my speculation is Post Malone was in contract renegotiations. Mm-hmm. So now we're not putting as much. So oomph behind. We now would you like you. We own. would like you to resign. I'm assuming. Uh-huh. I ain't spoken about it. Okay. We would like you to resign. If you're not gonna resign. On the other side of that, it would be, yo, pay me like you want me to resign. Mm-hmm. But on the flip side, it's no, finish that out like you're signed already. And then we can have that conversation. And that's where the stalemate is. So now he's got an album coming. They didn't update the label beef. They didn't come back to tell us, yo, we fixed it. Yo, we signed. Yo, we did this. All it is is June 3rd. I'm going to tell you how I can already tell us something fishy here. It's really, really easy to see. Artists of this magnitude are not announcing on April 27th that the album is coming June 3rd. 3rd. Yeah. That Ain't right no there. no singles, nothing? Yeah. They so got when, a single. When a weekend do, record. When does the quote-unquote announcement typically come? Fam, we just seen... No, I'm asking you. No, no, no. no, no, no I'm, I'm, yeah. I'm giving you an example. Like, let's use future. Whatever Adele did. Six weeks. I don't even... No. Ice is saying sooner. I'm Two saying... Weeks. Yeah, yeah. Two weeks. With him? Ice is saying. They've been talking about this album. You see what Future did. Drop Yo, album is dropping in two weeks or a week, whatever it was. And then the rollout was that week leading up to the album. Front page of a major publication. Yeah, you know yeah. I mean? whole, you see, you could tell when it's some, we're going to make sure you do these numbers. Yeah. This I'm saying, is, I'm saying Post, I need some lead out. I'm saying Post is big enough to not have the single and have the label support. And if that scenario was happening, we might get a six week announcement and then watch the label do its magic over the course of six weeks. We're not seeing that with Post. We haven't seen Post Malone, anything. It's and festival this album season. is one month away. It's was festival po- was season. Was Post at, Co- at Coachella? I don't think so. I don't think so. No. He would have been a headliner. No. I'm coming in here to investigate that. That's he would have been a headliner. He All these been. festivals have been. The, we watched these lineups. I haven't seen That's his true. name on any of these festivals. That's, true. That's a fact. Just something to watch out for. Yeah, you yeah. Can see it. It's, it's, just something it's to the look tea out leaves, for. That's the tea all. Leaves is talking. Damn, you can see it. I'm telling you. You know when they want you to win and when they want you to lose. I mean, the fans don't know that, but you could tell. You could tell for sure. You could tell. Fam, um, Kanye pulled out of Coachella and they didn't go get Post Malone. Word. Hmm. Gotcha. What were we talking about? We were talking about Jack Harlow. No, y'all. I'm <laughs> done. No, 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 no. What What else were we Were we talking about? Oh, no, we were talking about Jack Harlow's album Album title, which is Come Home, The Kids Miss You. Mm. And I thought that that profound point needed to be expounded upon. Because have I tried that? (laughs) What, that long? I've tried Come Home, I'm About to Kill Myself. (laughs) That was your go-to. That was one of your top fives you used to say. Ish, our friendship doesn't behoove me today. Like, (laughs) us having a history. It doesn't put me in the best position to win, like you recalling things from our past. <laughs> um, I've tried come home, I'm going to kill myself. I've tried come home, you left a couple Louis bags here. <laughs> That's when I realized there was a new level of mad to be unlocked with women. Like, And I think all men need to go through that. Like When you call her and she say, no, nah, just burn all that shit. <laughs> Damn. Some expensive yo, shit? Yo, throw it out. The, 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 all of the, everything, <laughs> the thirty-seven all of your, thousand words. All of your stuff. <laughs> <laughs> I put it on eBay and bro, bust you down. Wait, I caused you so much hurt, pain, and turmoil. 
that you just down to start a new? You don't even want the <laughs> whole bag? collection? That is a character builder. Yeah. Hey, Louis ain't putting this bag out again. Word. You sure? This That's was a the, gift. Limited, <laughs> limited edition. Yeah, it's over for that. She don't care. Mm. Yeah, that one don't really work anymore. What else have I tried? Now, nah, if she don't want the gifts, that hurts. I didn't say come on the kids, miss you, because I didn't have the kids. I didn't have the kids. You, you, ain't, tell well, her, you, ain't, you ain't hit her moms and ask her moms to ask her to come home? I've hit moms before. <laughs> that was the one, and yo. Say, yo what's He's going also on? dropping what? this on Mother's Day weekend. What's going with on title? with your daughter, yo? yo what's <laughs> no, up? Let me tell you what happened. Yo, no, yo. you agree with what that shit she did? <laughs> I've tried the mother, too. Nah, because I'd be fly with the mom. Yeah, uh-huh. yeah, yeah, yeah. It gotta be. Mom's got your back. Mm-hmm. Come see me, the kids. That's Miss crazy, you. Man. Listen, Mother's Day is coming. Ladies, come on, let's have a heart to heart right now. Listen. It's a consistent thing that happens over the course of I've seen it time and time again. <laughs> Each year on Mother's Day, yo. As men, sometimes you're not with your kid's mom, but Mother's Day is coming. So you want to show your appreciation and your gratitude for the job that she's doing and and, and helping to raise your child and taking on that responsibility. It's tough. Full-time mom. I know. It'd be, it'd be, it'd be, listen, I know because it's tough being a dad. So I can imagine it's tough being a mom. Sure. Right. So y'all get all the praise and credit in the world. Right. But sometimes that fucks shit up with who we fucking. Sometimes we have to explain why we love our kids, mom still. <laughs> <laughs> sometimes you have to go through why you're showing this. Gesture, this kind gesture, this token of appreciation. And I'm that's to where things can get. Tricky, what do you mean you're trying to follow, man? I'm just trying to follow because I would think... I bought mine a Rolex one time just to do it. Just to do it. Here, just because. You're so great and amazing. Mm-hmm. And that was a problem. Roughest month of my life. <laughs> and I'm joking right now for conversation purposes. Okay. I, I mean, I'm, I'm, But I'm that, to be mature that about can it. get... That can potentially... It didn't get rough for me, but that can get tricky. Why think, you just... My, hey, I put it to you this way. Look, mm. not to be in a girlies business, but... I'll be in the girlies business sometimes. <laughs> uh-huh. And a hey, timestamp. We're going to bleep every one of these names. <laughs> was allegedly with uh-huh. posting videos and everything. Uh-huh. I saw that. Video surfaced of in bed with his baby moms. F- shoes off, socks off. Comfy. Oh, you're, TV not gonna on. In, you're not gonna get in bed with your shoes on. Yeah. You gotta take your shoes See, on. See, already we in tricky land, right? Shouldn't you be able to be in bed with your kid and your kid's mom? Y'all would say yes as men. No, I would not say yes as men, Joe. Oh, okay. If, if I'm if I'm dating someone, no, I should not be in bed with my kid. You can't be in a bed with your clothes on with your kid and your kid's mom? Not in bed, no. No. Sets a bad sense. Intimate it's setting. A, a couch. Anyway, the same thing. The, st- the same thing stands with a couch or a love seat or just a close nah, quarters. That bed's a little different. Yeah, I'm, I'm slight bit up, a little different. All right, well, she was in the bed. They was in bed, laid up, mm-hmm. and then the next day, uh, came out and said, "No, nah, I'm single. I don't know why y'all ever thought I was with somebody." Uh, she started tweeting. She said, "Yo, somebody woke up blocked today." <laughs> like, uh, yeah, she said, she did all of that. The niggas is outside, and I'm watching, and I'm thinking to myself, "Why?" A nigga can't chill with his baby mom. Can I, can I? Don't y'all try to attack wait, me. Wait, wait, can I, can I keep it a buck? Are you going to? Yeah. Go ahead. This is not a pander. We don't know what dude was telling. And when, that's where shit gets tricky. Honestly, when you start downplaying a relationship over here to, to the new girl, and then she sees something that's the opposite of what you've been saying. Listen, I'm speaking from the position of a guy that is not fucking his baby moms. But shit can happen to where it may look like y'all are closer than. Yo, you being on good terms with your kid's mom shouldn't put you in a beef with your uh, significant other. I'm, I agree. It should. 100%. It should but not. it does. And since that's never happened to you guys and really me for the most part, we can't really get into it. But Mother's Day is about to get tricky for some nicks. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. No question. Some, nicks, some men are about to not. Send a gift to their child's mom. Mm-hmm. Well, they about to be just to avoid a headache 
in the house because you already walk around with the notion of someone thinking that you might fuck your kid's mom. That's what I'm saying there. Yeah, and 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 again, uh, a lot of that is niggas' faults, though, Joe. A lot of niggas lie about the relationship with their baby moms. They do. They keep her. They think because I got that connection with her that I always can I get so. back with that. I got resistance when to I that. need to. I got resistance to that. I've seen yes, it a lot of a niggas lie. Times. So, but but so if but she's but, di- but wait, because that's the worst case scenario. And when thinking about shit, I try not to think of the worst case scenario. In the so best case, think. in a bet, well not. But only the worst case scenario. I want to only think for it. In okay. the best case scenario, a nigga's being honest, mm-hmm. but the relationship fluctuates. <laughs> That's true. Mm. So that now, true. are you to report every time you're on good standing, bad standing, great speaking terms? It's a little rocky this month. Hey, the drop off was just dry. But like, what are you supposed to do as a man in that instance? Yeah, that's. Ah. Uh... That's where... It, and what it, position little, do you take? Yeah, get a, it get a little tricky. Some men there. take the position of, yo, if I'm with you and I love you, I don't want to have no conversation about my kid's mom. Ever. Her spot is That's my kid's mom. That's my kid's mom. You shouldn't even be mentioning her. But they do. Of course they do. Yeah. But you shouldn't. And, and as the man, you got to kind of... And that's what I'm telling you. There's a so bit. many benefits to having an ugly baby mom, yo. Like, <laughs> women try to ignore that shit. Like, women be trying to use it to shame you, but it's perks. <laughs> <laughs> Forget it. <laughs> and y'all stop doing that shit. Lady, hey, <laughs> fellas, I'm telling y'all, Mother's Day come at least three hours of that Mother's Day, your girl is gonna be on your baby mom's page. <laughs> For what? <laughs> Same thing they go on Valentine's Day. All of the important days are like snitch days. Let me see what's going on over there. <laughs> let me let me see what kind of Mother's Day gift you got. Did you just get some chocolates, mm, they or was it some dick in a box? Like, <laughs> what what did you get her? <laughs> yo, this it's, what I, it's gonna be a wake up call for some people out there. This what I walk back to, yo. That's crazy, <laughs> Fam, That's funny. I, what do yo? I'm but you're in a great standing with both of your baby moms. Thank the Lord. Yes. That, that's dope. It's super Yeah, dope. when I say these things, I'm not talking about me. No, that's dope, though. No, it's super dope that now you can really buy dope shit. Right. But part of, get, part of getting a great stand is with your baby mom is having some of these conversations I, and, I would and, agree. and spending some money. <laughs> he has to spend some money now. Y'all think, see, that's the niggas' problem. <laughs> Y'all think getting cool with your baby moms is free. <laughs> y'all, y'all think, oh, I'm a good guy, but yo, I held it down on the breakup. Yo, we got a co parent. How do we co parent? Yo, but we co parent. <laughs> That's what niggas. Fair. I know y'all can't talk about it. Just leave me on the ledge. You, I'm here. Yo, you I'm still, here by myself. Yo, you, we got co parent. Co ain't free. <laughs> You got you got to spit a bag on your ex. <laughs> to get cool. No, 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 no. That's that. That's that's where you're mistaken. It? It's not your oh, ex. Yo, you right. Not your you ex. You are correct. It's, it's your current. I got plenty of exes. It's your I current. Yeah. yeah. You got forever. You got to spend that bag. And that's school. where it turns like quality of life and all that shit come in. <laughs> Y'all playing? All right, forget it, yo. yo not <laughs> wait, forget it. I knew what time it was. I went to pick Lex up. Just to, 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 you know, he really likes to run around and we need more space. Yo, say less. If you want to know how I became baby daddy of the year, it's say less. Mm. <laughs> it's say less. <laughs> y'all got that word, right? Let me know when you get it. Just That's find it. it. Just find it and send it to me. <laughs> now, y'all want to know what my nigga brain was saying? <laughs> <laughs> I can tell you what my nigga brain was what, saying. What, what, what the nigga brain? It started, I know, then, it started, I'm te- then it's in the universe. It started, oh, with, a, it started yeah, no. with a B was in the front of the yeah, word. No, uh, no uh, but... Uh, but you know you got to fight nigga brain. You have to combat that yeah, nigga the brain shit get that you your brain up. be telling yeah. you to do. Right. Nigga brain you know, get you jammed up. You know life is life is better this way. <laughs> life is better this way. I haven't decided what I'm getting her for Mother's Day, but I am going to get her some. Dope. Something nice. I'm but sure. part of the game Dope. is you getting anybody some. I'm getting both my of baby course. mom some. Um, give my mom girl some. Give my mom should. some. I'm giving my uh, Jackie some. My dad's wife. Mm-hmm. Like I'm yeah. getting anybody. That's how you do. Something. That's how you do. That's how well, you should. No, Joe Biden. Enough of daddy.